Hello everyone! Welcome back to Technic Force Tutorials. In this video, I will show you how to install Chorus Funnels on your domain root. Let's get started! For installing Chorus Funnels, first you will have to go to the membership page and enter in your email ID and password here. Then Sign in. Then it will open the homepage for your membership area, and this is how it would look like. Now, for installing Chorus Funnels, click on the Manual Installation tab found on the sidebar. And here you will see a step by step guide on how to install Chorus Funnels as well as Cloud Funnels. So, first, click on the Download button to download the Chorus Funnels script. Then right at the bottom left, you will see the zip folder downloading. But in my case, as I have already downloaded mine, I will not proceed with it. But if you haven't, just wait on yours to finish. So now we will move on to the installation process. You can install it on any kind of Linux-based hosting. For example, I have a cPanel hosting and will log in. Once you're logged in, go to your file manager located on the Files section. Click on it and it will open a new tab. Now here on your file manager, you will see a folder called public underscore HTML. You have to install it in this folder for your root directory. Here, I am installing in a subdomain named as tutorials.g4life.in and I will be installing it in the root folder. If you're installing in the root folder, make sure that you don't have any kind of website installed over here. Otherwise, it's possible that it will take over your current website and you may lose your data. So my current domain is totally empty. So I'm going to install it in the root folder. To do it, click on the upload button and upload the zip file, which we have downloaded earlier. Now select your files then it will start uploading. It may take a few minutes and when it's done, go back to your file manager and click on reload. And as you can see, the folder has been uploaded. Now we'll need to extract the files. After that's done, you will then see the files extracted. Now we don't need the zip file folder, so you can just delete this. Just click on it and select Delete from the top bar and confirm it. Now, go to your domain section, the page where you will install Course Funnels. From here, you can choose your desired language in the drop down list. Then click on Continue. Here, Enter your database username, database password, database name, and port number if required. For this one, I will create a new database. Here, I'm going to my hosting site. From the database section, I'll click on MySQL database wizard. Enter in the name, then click on the next step. Now it will show you a prompt for creating a database user. And you can enter in a password of your choice, or you can generate one from here. Then click on Create User. Now the user is successfully created. Now I will click on this box to give all privileges to this user. Then go to the next step. You will now see the user is added to the database. Now click on the Return to MySQL Database. Here in the MySQL Database, you will see your database and users as well as the new one we have created. Now, go back to the Admin panel, enter in the username. I'll just copy it from here and paste it over here. Make sure to remove extra spaces that we've copied. Next, enter your database password. 
and your database name. Now you can write your port number if you want. For now, it's not necessary to write it because Chorus Funnels will automatically connect the default port. So for now, let's leave it as it is. Then click on Submit. Now it will ask me to put my name, email ID, and password. So enter it all here. Then submit. It will then take us to the login page. Again, enter in your credentials here and log in. And it will open the dashboard for us. So here you can enter in your email ID. And for the license code, go back to the membership page. Then tap on the Manage Licenses tab. Here you can see all the licenses that you have. You can also generate a new one. Just click on this button. You will need to enter the path URL here. And to do that, just go to your dashboard and copy the URL. And paste it back here. And generate your new license. After that, Copy it, and paste it here, and click on Verify. Once it's verified, you will be redirected to the main page to create your course funnels. And there you have it. You have now installed it successfully, and you can start creating your funnel. And that is it for today's video. I hope you find it helpful. Thank you for watching, and see you on the next one.